The FDA is set to meet next Tuesday to discuss the Pfizer vaccine for those kids. If approved by the CDC and the FDA, those vaccines would roll out for the younger kids early next month. WFMY News 2's Avery Powell learned both Guilford and Forsyth County Health Departments are preparing to give kids their first dose. The Guilford County Health Department says they will start giving the Pfizer COVID-19 vaccine to kids 5 to 11 years old once approvals are locked down. On Tuesday, North Carolina health officials sent a letter to providers across the state asking them if they would like to be a part of the first wave of vaccinations. Guilford County did not confirm they would be part of that first wave, but Forsyth County's health director says it will take part. Forsyth County will get 3,900 doses initially. There are about 20,000 kids in the 5 to 11 age range who are expected to get the vaccine in Forsyth County. The Forsyth County Health Director says his team can do 2,500 doses per day, five days a week and one Saturday per month. In the first one to two weeks, he says it could take some time for kids to get the vaccine, but it's important that they do. Obviously, it protects the children. I know some people are going to say, well, children aren't as at high risk of complications, and that is true. That's what we're seeing. Uh, unfortunately, sometimes uh, when you look across the whole U.S., there have been some children um, that have had very serious uh, COVID complications and some have died. But it's also just about the bigger community and slowing that spread. The FDA will meet next Tuesday. If they approve it for emergency use, the CDC will meet in the beginning of November. We also reached out to Atrium Health, Wake Forest Baptist, and Novant Health. Both of them said they will offer the vaccine to this age group, but cannot confirm to me today whether they will be in that first wave. The vaccine could, be, could start being given out in the first two weeks of November. New at 6 o'clock, just moments ago, the FDA cleared booster shots of the Moderna and Johnson & Johnson vaccines. The federal health officials also approved the mixing and matching of booster doses for Pfizer, Moderna, and J&J. &J. So that means you do not have to get an additional dose from the same brand of your first vaccine. The CDC has the final say, though. A CDC panel will meet tomorrow. Then the CDC director will issue her official recommendations.